Right folks, the moment of truth. I have got this hollowed now down to about, the wall is about 13 millimeters thick, about half an inch. I was aiming for 10, but I think I've hit where I want to be in around about 160, what I was aiming for. 160, 165. I'm hoping to get that. I'll not have, I'll not have to hollow the lid, but we'll see now because I've just I've filled it up with um, sawdust. So the sawdust hasn't been compressed. So it's sitting loose, so it'll fall in here loose, and whatever volume in here is going to be the same as in here. So you're seeing this, I'm seeing this at the same time as you, I, I haven't seen this yet. I decided to see how exciting it would be. Oh yes, before I go on any further, I need to get 126. So I'm looking 125, 57, I have 100. 125 just about here I'm looking for okay so if we get in there I'm absolutely bang on 125 25 50 so it's 25 above the line 50 above 75 125 so it's just just that black line basically so if I get above that black line I've hit my target but I'm expecting to be in somewhere about here probably you know in around here we'll soon see It's very heavy on this to lift this up. That's better now. That's it. So we'll just. What have we got? 175. That's it done. That's it done. That's the hollowing done. And as you can see inside there. It's all gone, it's a nice wall thickness and it's fairly smooth. Now I'll just give it a bit more of a smooth and now to thin it off and then I can seal it, sand that and seal it and then start doing the uh, doing the uh, the lid. So I'm really happy. So the hollowing's done folks and we're at 100 and so I know now that there's no way that can't be big enough. So it'll mean if anybody if you want to put a liner in as well, as in I'll probably put in some sort of a liner in. I sent it with a bag, that's not very elegant. And then um, Alan suggested um, epoxy, epoxy resin, and then he very kindly offered me gold leaf. But I explained to him that one time I put gold leaf on the outside of a little bowl, and it ended up with more on me than there was in the bowl, and it would be a dis complete disaster if I was trying to put gold leaf inside this. But the resin might do, and then we're thinking about gold resin. But sometimes it's thinking about that as to what I was talking to a couple of guys this morning. Actually, we're over here looking at this. And one of them said that the resin, if you put the colour in, it might just weaken it slightly. And I said, right, that's okay. He said it shouldn't, but it's another thing to think about. So we'll see how it goes. I'm going to finish it off on the inside first anyway and see what it looks like. And then we'll take it from there, okay? But that's where we are. The hollowing is done. And we've got a hundred. And you've seen it yourselves. The evidence is there. So we know that we're going to fit. I needed, I needed to get up to there. So I'm up to there. So it means that everything's grand. Okay, oh, I'm really happy with that actually. And there are three guys here this morning Ricky and Stephen and Joe were here this morning and they all had a go at the hollowing setup. And why am I sitting talking to you there when I could be talking to you up here? Let us see. Oh, oh, forgot to tighten the thing down. I need to get a little bit higher. So I'm looking up my nose, right? I had Ricky and Joe and Stephen here this morning and they all had a go at the hollowing thing and they thought it was fantastic. Stephen has it. He has a camera as well. I'm thinking of buying the camera system too because it would mean I wouldn't have to bend over to see inside it, you know. So I'm thinking of going for that maybe, you know. So, uh, as I say, they were very impressed with it and Joe was just fascinated by the urn and he wants to come back and see me. When I put the lid on, I have to then blend the two ends together and he wants to come back and see me doing that. So uh, I'll do a wee video as well, let you see that. So I'm happy. Now the next stressful thing is fitting the lid to the top of this. But I've got plenty of beef here. I have plenty of beef, you can see there. There's loads of things. I want to get a real good, solid fix here. So I want to get a real nice tight fit. But I've got plenty to play with, so I'm all right. So there's, that's where we are, folks, and I'm very happy. Okay, all the best now. Bye-bye. Oh, where are we at? Thanks.